Welcome to our educational channel from class 4, the chapter number 7 is the fractions. So to improve the basic skills in mathematics, especially in these fractions, so I will show 4 to 5 basic concepts. So each and everything you should learn perfectly, then will be perfect in this chapter. So I am providing one link in description below, so around 18 pages of document or PDF file. We can get it, then practice the problems in that PDF and by listening this video. So concept wise I will explain one by one. So every method or every topic, 3, 4 sums I will explain, right? So remaining all you need to practice from the PDF file or from the worksheet. Then it will be perfect in this chapter. For example, first one, convert into the mixed fractions. If an improper fraction is given, we have proper, improper and mixed, right? The numerator is smaller than denominator, it's a proper fraction. So we have proper. Numerator is smaller, like 2 by 7. So numerator is smaller than denominator, it's a proper. These are improper fraction. Numerator is greater than denominator. Improper fractions we can convert into mixed fraction by dividing. Take 24 divided by 5. 5 table. 5 times 4. 20 and remainder is 4. Now we should write this quotient. This is the quotient and remainder and this is the divisor. First we should write the quotient. So the answer is 4. Quotient you should write. Then this is the way you can take. First quotient, remainder by divisor. So 4, 4 by 5. This is the mixed fraction. Okay. Let us see next example. Ninth one. 37 divided by 7. You take 37 divided by 7. 7 times 5 is 35. Then 2. So first we should write the quotient 5. Then remainder by this divisor. 5 2 by 7 is answer. Okay, this answer is 5 2 by 7. So 7 table 7 into 5 is 35. So extra 2. Same way. 43 divided by 2. So 2 times 2 is 4. So 21. So we we'll take 43 divided by 2. 2 2 is a 4. If you 3 take normal division you can do it. 2 1 is a 2 and remainder is 1. So 21 then remainder is 1. 1 by 2. 21 1 by 2. So this is the you can convert improper fraction to mixed fraction. So anything is given same pattern you apply. Even let us see this so uh, 11th one 17 divided by 8 8 table 8 2 is so 16 no so 1 remainder so 2 1 by 8 okay this is the mixed track uh, improper to mixed once perfect all the problems in this next we have reverse improper fraction this is a mixed fraction to improper 4 7 by 9 4 7 by 9 same this is take this multiply this value 4 into 9 with the answer we need to add the next number this is addition so 9 into 4 you can multiply then add 7 divided by same denominator 9 is the denominator same as this 9 into 4 36 and 36 plus that 7 you need to add it 13 so 43 43 divided by 9 you can check 43 divided by 9 you do, you can convert into again mixed, you will get same. So to convert mixed fraction to improper, denominator into this number, this whole number, whole number and fraction, right? Whole number and proper fraction, denominator you multiply with this whole number, 10 into 3. You should multiply plus the numerator, this is the numerator part, entire. Divide by whatever denominator is the same as this will write. That is 10 3 is a 30 plus 7. So 37 by 10 is the answer. Okay. This is the pattern or method you follow. For example, next one. 11 into 3 is what? 33. Plus 8. Divide by 11 again. So 41 divided by 11. Okay. This is where you can practice all the pages from this. Next we have comparing the fractions. One worksheet. So few problems I'm showing from different worksheets. So you need to practice remaining all same pattern. Next, compare the fractions. We have to say which is the greater. 
4 by 5, 5 by 14. So in that case, we need to make into like fraction. They are unlike fraction, right? If you our denominators are same, by observing numerators, we can say which is bigger and smaller. 5 and this is 14. Not common, not same. So you multiply this 14, this multiply with 5. Opposite you can do it. Since you are multiplying with 5 denominator, same 5 multiply for the numerator. You are multiplying with 14 now, same 14 you can multiply. Now denominators are same, 5 into 14 and 14 into 5 are same. Now check on the numerator, 4 into 14, 5 into 5. 14 times 4, 5 times 5. 5 times 5 is 25, okay, this value. And 14 times 4, so 4 is 16, 56. 56 and 25, which is greater 56. So 4 by 5 is greater than 5 by 14. Okay, this is the way, comparing the fractions. See one more example. 5 by 8, 11 by 15. So what is the denominator? 8 is here. Okay, what is the denominator? 15. They are not same, right? Opposite way. So this denominator multiply this side. This denominator multiply right side. Since you are multiplying 8 to the denominator, same 8 should multiply for the same fraction numerator. So this is 15. Then only value does not change. If it's the same number, if you multiply or divide, fraction remains same. Now denominators are same. 15 into 8, 8 into 15. Just only compare the numerators. 11 into 8, 15 into 5. 15 times 5 is 75. 11 into 8 is 88. 75, 88. This is small, right? So answer also less. Okay. This is the way you apply the compare the fractions all the pages. Next page also similarly can do it. Okay, once perfect that uh, method after practicing the worksheets, next to see uh, simplifying the terms, simplifying the fractions into lowest two terms. This is important. 4 by 40 is fraction, but we must make into lowest two terms. Should not have any common factor for 4 and 40 if we simplify. But 4 and 40, 2 is the common factor. So 2, 2 is a 4. Same 2, you must divide with 40. 2, 20. 2 by 20. 2 by 20, again, we have common factor. So 2 ones are 2, 10. 1 by 10. 1 by 10, no common factors except 1. Similarly, 12 by 33, no common factors. Okay, we have what? 3 is the table, 3 factor. 3 we can cancel. 3 times 4, same 3 table, 11. So 4 by 11 is answer. This is 1 by 7 because 2 ones are 2, 7. Remember, same table you can cancel with numerator and denominator. 4 and 6, 2, 2 is a 4, no, 2, 3 is a 6. So 2 by 3. 20 divided by 30. So 10, 2 is a 10, 3 is a 2 by 3. Just simplify its lowest two terms. Once simplified, you check. No common factor except 1. Okay, just you need to practice all. Once perfect all the concepts in this last previous last 3-4 pages, I am giving about uh, addition and subtraction of the fractions. Okay, just I will explain the method. Here example is 2 by 3 plus 4, 3 by 4 minus 7 by 12. Okay, 2 by 3 plus 3 by 4 minus 7 by 12. We should make the fractions as like fractions, like terms. So means uh, denominator must be same. We should make it as a like fraction. If you observe 3, 4, 12, they are not same. So you can take 3, 4, 12, find out the least common multiple first. 3 table, 3 ones are 3, 4 remains same, 3 fours are 12, 4 table, 4 ones are already no LCM no. So 3 into 4. So 12 is LCM. Now we should make every denominator as the 12. So in 3 table, what we should multiply to becomes 12, 4. Same 4 you multiply for the numerator. Don't forget. Next, 4 table, 3 is a. So same 3 you can multiply. 12 table, 1. Same 1 we multiply. So we should make it as denominator must be same. Now it became 2, 4, so 8 by 12 plus 9 by 12 minus 7 by 12. 8 by 12, if you simplify, you'll get 2 by 3 only. So 2 by 3 exactly equals to 8 by 12. 3 by 4 is exactly equals to 9 by 12. 
3 by 4 exactly equal to 9 by 12 then 7 by 12. Once denominators are same you just can simplify the numerators. Numerators what here 8 plus 9 minus 7 same denominator there is no change 12 8 plus 9 minus 7 if you just add and subtract 8 plus 9 17 minus 7 so 10 10 by 12 now you can simplify this again lowest terms so 5 by 6 is the final answer addition subtraction of the fractions you need to perfect practice this all the worksheets regarding the sign in between you can apply main thing is you should make the same denominator by taking LCM and practice this is the basic concepts in these fractions, simplifications, converting like fractions, improper mixed fraction. This all you should perfectly from the worksheets to be perfect in these uh, fractions, in this all basic skills in maths.